Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to customize a can cooler. This project is super simple. All you'll need is your can cooler, even some scrap heat transfer vinyl, some scissors, and a weeding tool. Before I start my project, I always measure my surface area to decide what size I need to cut my design. Then using your Cricut or Silhouette, you're going to cut your design and weed away the excess vinyl. This is regular heat transfer vinyl, but you can use flock if you find that the color is trying to bleed through or even glitter because both materials are thicker and that will help you if your colors try to bleed. I got this design from Cricut Design Space and it's free with Cricut Access. Once you have your design weeded, you're ready to press. Because heat transfer already comes on a carrier sheet, you don't need any type of transfer tape. You just place it right over your material and you're ready to press it on. For this can cooler, I'm going to use my Cricut Easy Press. It's perfect for these small projects. And I'm going to use my Easy Press mat because you do need something for the project to press into. If you don't have an easy press mat, you can use a towel, a folded shirt, anything that will give you a little bit of cushion. I'm going to press one time at 320 for 30 seconds. And then the vinyl carrier sheet is ready to peel. These can coolers are super fun to customize. They make a great unique gift you can find them online and I will link them in the description box below. So thanks guys for watching. Subscribe to my channel, like the video if it was helpful, and until next time, thanks guys. 